Hey everybody, it's gosh almost midnight here and I'm still awake. I should be sleeping, but uh, I'm not. So I just decided to do a video. Um, this 13 personal questions tag has been going around a while. So I'm just getting to it. And uh, hopefully this will help you guys get to know me a little bit better as I'm filming waiting to film and upload more videos of how to's and you know makeup of the day or face of whatever those videos are called I don't know what I'm gonna call them but um, yes I promise I'll start doing makeup videos and I do do a good job it just doesn't seem like it because I'm always I'm always uh, looking kind of scraggly or crappy on them um, on these videos just because it's you know long days and being a parent is you know tiring and difficult but this is luckily one of my um, outputs so I'm really happy to be doing this and have this channel <clears throat> and hopefully I won't sound bored boring I mean because I think I have been in these past videos and I'm apologize for that but anyways here goes the 13 personal questions tag and I tag um, all of my subscribers and anyone who uh, who watches this video to do one too because it just ha helps us get to know um, the youtubers that we watch um, and it helps us to get to know them better and help you get to know me better so the first question is what do you order at Starbucks I order a venti vanilla bean frappuccino with soy milk I love it it's yummy it has uh, no caffeine in it I don't drink caffeine um, except for an occasional iced tea here and there um, and I get it with soy milk because I can't drink regular milk and um, it's still just as good and sometimes I get caramel in it and it's so yummy um, so I highly suggest that one um, Sorry, I'm moving around so much I'm on my laptop here. My cat keeps... I'm looking at him to tell him to stop. <laughs> he keeps rubbing up against the computer. Anyways, um, the second one is, what's one thing in your closet that you cannot live without? Probably my flip-flops. I wear flip-flops in the summer. I wear them in the winter. We're out here in California, so it's... Uh, you know, even in the winter, other than the rainy days, it's pretty much a shoe of choice for at least me. Um, what's one thing that most people probably wouldn't know about you? Um, let's see. Uh, number one, I'm from Guam. I was born there and raised there until about fourth grade. And I have an, a lot of family members back there, but... I sure do not look like I'm from there. My mom's um, Guamanian and my dad's uh, Caucasian. Or different backgrounds, you know, all different mixes. But, um, yep, I sure don't look like I'm from Guam, from an island in the middle of the ocean. Um, let's see. So that's one thing. And then one more thing I'm going to add, and I might start doing videos um, of this, like... Um, Rachel's doing on her channel about MS. Um, I'm a postpartum depression survivor. Um, I had my son three years ago, and after I had him, I went through some pretty severe postpartum depression, and um, that was very difficult. And I've, you know, come out of it, and I'm helping other moms and families through it um, through volunteer work or just spreading my story or talking to moms groups and things like that. So I think I might start doing videos on that. Um, that's a great idea that came from Rachel about um, doing videos for her MS and um, like her I'll be putting a postpartum depression story in the um, subject line so if you want to watch it you can and if not you don't have to that's your choice and that's why we have free will um, let's see name one thing that you want to do before you die for real lose weight and get healthy because the rate I'm going um, I don't want to die because of my weight or because of my lack of um, health and I want to be here for my son and 
maybe if we have any other children for them too and my family and just want to lead a healthy lifestyle. Um, what's one food that you cannot live without? That's a good question. Probably, it's kind of weird, but rice. I love rice. I guess, you know, from how I grew up, but we have rice with everything. Whether it's red rice, which is rice with the chote um, seeds, you know, it's, it's red and it soaks up the, the rice soaks up the color and it's so good. Or brown rice or, you know, long grain rice or jasmine rice. I love rice and I think my son's getting that same addiction and he loves rice and soy sauce a lot. So, kind of funny. Um, what quote or phrase do you live your life by? This too shall pass. That is, I can't repeat that enough. And then also everything happens for a reason. And change the only constant in life is change so hopefully one of those three mantras will uh, help you out if you don't have one um, what do you like and dislike about the YouTube community um, I don't have an opinion on that because I'm so new to here um, I've s subscribed to a lot of um, channels and you know just like um, watching different um, different broadcasts and things but um, you know I, I'm just starting mine so I'm not sure about that part but I think one thing I might dislike is that when even though like I mean you know, I'll probably show you my makeup collection or I'll probably you know I'll show you different things that I have just for your information and that's probably what everybody else has the intention of doing when they show you their makeup collection or their new makeup or their haul or this or that um, and it's almost like you feel kind of pressure to go out and buy things like that whether you have the money or not um, so if you have the money to buy the higher end um, makeup or the makeup that other people are really raving about then you know go right ahead but if it's gonna stick you in a hole then it's probably safe to either buy, sorry, I have cat hair all over me now, you know, duplicates or, I've got hair in my eyes now, or drugstore makeup or anything like that. Um, that's why I like uh, Emily's videos over on Beauty Broadcast. She kind of does a little mix of everything. And then also, um, I think her, I don't know what her name is, but it's Glam Life Guru, and she goes and does, like, weekly or daily, um, well, she does weekly um, videos at stores like CVS and Rite Aid and things like that. They're drug stores um, at, here on the West Coast, but I don't know if you guys have them in the Midwest or the East Coast, but, you know, you can... We probably have something similar or whatever. Um, so those are my likes or dislikes or whatnot. Um, what's your number one most listened to song on iTunes? <laughs> I don't know. Um, oh, yeah. My husband just downloaded it for me. I got it from a video, one of these... Um, makeup videos and she had it in her video and then I was at a baseball game the other night and it's a minor league so one of the um, batters had their song playing this song and I'm like who is this group I don't know because um, each one of the baseball the hitters um, get like a lead-in song that kind of pumps them up or whatever so I went back to her uh, video and finally found that the name of the um, the group is Kings of Leon, and the song is Closer. And I love that song, and I got it from iTunes, and um, and I just love listening to the song. I'm so sorry, I got cat hair all over me. This is just awful. Um, so I like that song, and I think that's like the only song I like from them. But I'll have to keep up with others. 
and um, Adele. I just had my husband download that. I mean, I can download. I'm computer literate, but I'm, you know, let him do that kind of work. <laughs> Make him feel uh, special. So, um, um, Rolling in the Deep, I like that song. Um, what kind of style would you define yourself as having? Mommy style. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I used to be up to date and you know, dress real hip, and you can see in my profile picture that's taken um, a few years ago before I had my son. My um, friend was taking a photography class, and uh, she took that picture, and it like actually won her a prize or something. But, um, anyways, yeah, um, mommy style, you know, crop pants, tank tops, or t shirts, and that's pretty much it. Hair pulled back. Um, some quick makeup on like kind of like I have on tonight I just went out to dinner with um, some of the moms from our moms group so um, got you know a little made up but maybe I'll do like a video of kind of a quick moms um, m you know makeup kind of a thing but anyways um, my favorite number is seven um, I guess I like three two so seven and three are my two favorite numbers. Um, two hobbies that I have are crafting and I love crafting, but it's like every kind of craft you can imagine. Oh, and I like reading too, but like reading more like, um, like nonfiction books than fiction. Two pet peeves. Um, people who drive slow in the fast lane and that's huge for me I just ugh, drives me nuts that's my number one right now um, and then the last one number 13 is guilty pleasure um, probably Starbucks it's like I feel like like I'm secretly going there and getting my drink or my um, my uh, sweets or whatever and just love to savor that and so that's my guilty pleasure so I hope you guys had a good time um, listening to this I hope you do the tag yourself so I can watch it on your channel and I'm sorry for the wiggly movement of my cat and also of me because I'm breathing on my stomach um, and uh, just, I don't, you guys, this, this uh, camera kind of sucks on this MacBook, but um, I'm wearing, let's see, where did this yellow shadow come Oh, it's the Gold Shadow by NYX. I'll put it in the, um, the information below. Um, and then uh, this really neat aqua liner in... I don't know it's, there's no color but it's like gold and I put it like um, around my top lashes and lower lashes and then put some black um, to just kind of um, cut it up and then the lipstick is um, like a I think it's what is it dervish lip liner from Mac and then um, an Urban Decay um, gloss and I'll put those in the down bar too but you know you can't really see it but it's a nice and easy um, look that I went for today because I was rushing and um, I did have powder on but um, it was hmm, I'm surprised it's not on anymore it's kind of is but anyways okay sorry I'm just going on a tangent and now my screensaver's on so uh that's it. I hope you had a decent time watching this and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.